Hello, good morning friends. Uh, today we will see the difference between uh, continue and next sentence. Uh, both continue and uh, next uh, sentence are used in uh, if conditions, uh, if else conditions or uh, evaluate statements. So now uh, let us look at uh, an example to see the uh, subtle difference between these two. Both continue and next sent uh, sentence uh, predominantly they do not do anything, it is just a null statement. It just transfers the control uh, of the statement one to an explicit scope terminator and the other to an implicit scope terminator. Uh, so uh, let us see with an example. Here we, I have uh, declared a variable called a which I have initialized to zeros and I have moved a value of 10 to this particular uh, variable and I have checked whether it is greater than 20. If it is greater than 20, then just display this number is greater than 20. Else, uh, in the else condition, I have written continue. And then I have done add 10 to a, add 10 to, I have uh, added uh, 10 to a twice, and then I have displayed it. Now, the same set of statements I have repeated here. If you look at this, so I have again, let me just scroll down. So here again, I have moved 10 to a. I have checked whether it is greater than 20. If it is greater than 20, just display it is greater than 20. Else part instead of continue given here the next sentence. And again the same set of statements. And I have displayed there the value of a when next sentence is used. Previously I have used the value of a when continue used. You will see the subtle difference. Both continue and next uh, uh, sentence do not do anything. They just transfer the control outside the loop. And continue transfers the control outside the you know uh, explicit scope terminator next sentence transfers this control after the implicit scope terminator okay so here what basically happens is i just explain here when i give continue continue transfers the control after the explicit scope terminator this is an explicit scope terminator Okay, I am going to remove the statements just for uh, you know explaining this concept. I am telling you the continue transfers to the statement after the explicit scope terminator. So end if is an ex anything end hyphen is generally referred to as explicit uh, scope terminator. This has been introduced in COBOL 85. So it transfers the control here and then so it adds 10 to a, it adds 10 to a and the value displayed will be 30 here the, because the initial value of a is 10 at uh, 10 to a will make it 20 here then it will make it 30 here. Now similarly when I do uh, uh, the same set of uh, statements instead of continue with next sentence now the control is transferred to the implicit scope terminator period dot is referred to as an implicit scope terminator. I don't have place here, so I'll just write it here. Okay. So the period here, so the control is transferred to th to the statement after this. So it will just add 10 to a. So the value of a was 10. This line is skipped because the control transfers to the statement after the next sentence where the period is there. So this is the next sentence. So the control is transferred here. The value displayed is 20. I have already compiled this program since I am not making any changes, so I will just come out of it. I will again if for your for this one I will just show the compilation process. So here the name of my program was uh, cont next, so I will just do a change all. submit it. I will wait for the result. Yes, compilation has gone successfully. So, let us execute it. Cobb cont next. So, it is cont next here. I just have a display statement. So, sysout is enough for me. So, I will submit it. Let us go to the spool to check our result. There you go. 
value of a when continue is used it was 30 value of a when next sentence is used it is 20 so it's generally recommended to use continue rather than next sentence in your uh, programming language uh, that's the cobol uh, this one because it transfers the control to the statement after the explicit scope terminate so this is preferred now if you see these two set of statements this one is preferred over next sentence because next sentence goes to the statement after a period which is the implicit scope terminator continue transfers the control to the statement after the explicit scope terminator next sentence transfers the control to the statement after the implicit scope terminator okay hope this uh, video helps you to understand the